It's a beautiful question. It's a standard template. X plus 1 by X and X square plus 1 by X square. So you take X plus 1 by X and you square it. You get X square plus 1 by X square plus 2. You take X minus 1 by X, you square it. You get X square plus 1 by X square minus 2. Learn it somewhere along the line, and then we just forget this. It's going to get used over and over and over again in several avatars. And so, what do we do? We take x plus 1 by x, call it as y. This will become, if this is y, this is y square minus 2. We solve for y, we get the values of y, and then plug in y as x plus 1 by x. We'll see whether we get two values for y, and which of the values of y will fit in for x. Both of them, right? Lovely. So, we, first of all, we plug it as y. So, this is y square minus 2. 3 times y square minus 2 minus 2y plus 5 equal to 0. 3y square minus 6 minus 2y plus 5 equal to 0. 3y so square minus 2y minus 1 is equal to 0. 3y so square minus 3y plus y minus 1 is 0. 3y into y minus 1 plus 1 into y minus 1 equals 0. 3y plus 1 into y minus 1 equals 0. Have we got this right? I'm going to fix this. y square minus 2, 3y square minus 6, minus 2y plus 5. Okay, so 3y square minus 2y minus 1 is 0. 3y plus 1 into y minus 1 is 0. So y could be 1 or y could be minus 1 by 3. And I hope you all got the same answer. y could be 1 or y could be minus 1 by 3. Now we come to this interesting part. x plus 1 by x equal to 1. x plus 1 by x equal to minus 1 by 3. x plus 1 by x is greater than or equal to 2 or less than or equal to minus 2. This does not yield roots, this does not yield roots, we should have zero real solutions. So we get two values for y, if we take x plus 1 by x as y, y could be 1 or minus 1 by 3, that means x plus 1 by x should be 1, x plus 1 by x should be minus 1 by 3, x plus 1 by x is greater than or equal to 2 or less than or equal to minus 2, if x is positive, it is greater than or equal to 2, if x is negative, it is less than or equal to minus 2. So x plus 1 by x equal to 1 does not have real solutions, x plus 1 by x equal to minus 1 by 3 does not have real solutions. Zero real solutions. We just check. I'm a little worried about the answer. Yep, it works. Beautiful question. Plug it as y, get y, and then do not automatically make the assumption that for a value of y, we'll get two values of x because it's a quadratic equation. Finally, that, that x plus 1 by x is greater than or equal to 2 or less than or equal to minus 2 is a super important, simple idea. And x and 1 by x have the same sign, both positive or both negative. If x is positive, x plus 1 by x is greater than or equal to 2. If x is negative, x plus 1 by x is less than or equal to minus 2. Why so? Think about this very simple. If x is positive, x plus 1 by x by 2 is greater than or equal to square root of x into 1 by x. AMGM inequality x into 1 by x is 1, square root of 1 is 1, x plus 1 by x greater than or equal to 2. If x is negative, we can put x equal to minus y. We get y plus 1 by y is greater than or equal to 2, which means x plus 1 by x is less than or equal to minus 2. And so, this idea, x plus 1 by x is greater than or equal to 2 or less than or equal to minus 2. Very nice. Kind of one of those things that after we do a bunch of questions, we take for granted, plug into different contexts, super powerful. And so, we solve for y in this question. After we solve for y, we get two wonderful roots, 1 and minus 1 by 3. x plus 1 by x cannot be 1, cannot be minus 1 by 3, 0 real solutions. Hush.